Hey guys, it's Nima Stacker here and I'm back with you recording another video. If you ever get a chance to come to London and visit Covent Garden, it is one of the best places to go out, particularly in the summer in London. Lots of live music, lots of great crowds, good food, good place to go. And it's also good to receive a pile of coins in the mail. And these coins have been sent to me by one of the Silver Forum members for the June grading. So come the end of June, there'll be another lot of coins going off to uh, NGC. And uh, they've just started to arrive with a couple of weeks to go, and I think there'll be quite a few more uh, being graded. You tend to get a, uh, a lot of coins being graded where there are new releases, and I'm not sure whether in the last couple of weeks there's been a major new release. So it may be that um, actually it's going to be slightly fewer coins to be graded for the June, which kind of suits me because it's been a very busy time over the last couple of months with about four or 500 coins being graded. So, first out of the bubble wrap is a very big, very heavy coin. I am expecting it, I know what it is, and it's something which is hugely exciting. So, let's show you the back of this coin first. So, it's um, made by the Perth Mint on behalf of the island of uh, Nui, and it is it could be Perth Mint, actually. I need to check. It could be the New Zealand Mint. I'm not quite sure. But it's an island off, off New Zealand and Australia. And it's uh, on the subject of Steamboat Willie. So the first, the first feature film uh, starring Mickey Mouse in the 1920s, 1928. Um, just brilliant. This is such a cool thing. It's um, one kilogram silver coin, beautifully made. It's a proof edition. Um, I believe these are still available from the Mint if you search around. Um, you'll be able to get one of these if you want one. But just, you know, it's the first one kilogram silver coin that I've had in my hands. And it just really is pretty awesome, actually. Um, love it. I think it's great. It's got a very nice portrait, standard portrait of Her Majesty on the reverse, $100 denomination. I mean just look at this thing, this thing is just so massive. And uh, coins like this up to one kilo will fit in the NGC extra size holder. So uh, that's really what, what's going to happen to it. Um, unfortunately, I can't get a special label for it because if there are special labels, they're by their exclusive labels for some of the big dealers. So it'll have to have a brown label. But um, the other coins here are panda type coins, and uh, they will all be able to get special labels from the mint. Uh, this one is a copper 70 millimeter Trigos coin, and each one you can see is serialized individually at the bottom. And so when they put this in a slab, they'll put it in one of the extra large slabs. There'll be a little cutout on the slab so that you can see the uh, serial number at the bottom. And uh, I've had three of these graded so far, and uh, I think they got either two 70s and a 69 or three 70s. So they've been doing very well in grading, and they... Uh, they're great uh, coins to have, particularly if you like larger coins, if you look at the, the pattern on them. So the, the next little package contains um, panda coins. These are Fiat pandas. In other words, they're, they're ones produced by the, the kind of regular supplier of pandas. They do the little one ounce pandas, which are BU coins, which are uncirculated, and then the larger ones are always done as proofs. So it means they have a special strike, special finish, to a much higher standard. 
and uh, so it has a denomination of 50 yuan and you can tell from the three panels on the front this is a 2013 um, I mean look how shiny that is you can see these have been produced to a much higher standard than the regular coins and uh, they make a great addition to a collection I'm going to have the capsules kept by the uh, by NGC for these so that they can be kept with the original packaging which uh, helps when you eventually sell these coins to give the original box, the original COA, the original capsules. So if anybody does actually want to take them out of the slab at some stage, they then have the opportunity to do that. So uh, there's another one here coming out of the wrapping. And this one is another of the same type of coin, 50 yuan, um, the proof limited edition Panda. Um, this one is a 2016 coin. If you haven't got one, at least one of these in your collection, I recommend having one of them if you like pandas and collect pandas. Um, I don't know how good it is to collect the whole range of these. I guess it would be possible. They don't. You don't really see them coming up for sale very often, uh, and it's the first time I've seen any of these being graded by any of the Silver Forum members, but um, very interesting to have these larger size pandas around and to see what grades they get from NGC. So there you have it, uh, hopefully there'll be a few more for you over the next few days and weeks.